Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Shonice and welcome to Simply Neat Web. Today I thought of like a cool book thing we all can do interactively, do together. I thought that would be really cool to do like a book club type of thing. Like I give you some book options and you guys pick one and we all read this book together. So if you want to continue on looking at this video and pick your favorite book that I have chosen for you guys to select from, sit back, relax, and continue watching. But if you haven't already, go down below, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and also give this video a like sometime throughout the video. But other than that, let's get started with this video. Just like what I mentioned in the beginning of the video, I want to do like this book club video that we all can read together. We come back each week and to discuss about this book. So I chose two kind of like suspense type of books and also two romance books because like, come on now, I read romance books all the time so I had to put them in. So what are the books? The first book that I chose is this one and it's called The Woman in the Window by AJ Finn and it's this book right here and if you don't know like I I didn't know before because I haven't read this book personally this book is also a movie that is already out on Netflix but um, I thought this book was really cool so let's see what this one is about and I'm just gonna read you know what it's about Anna Fox lives alone a recluse in her New York City home and able to venture outside. She spends her days drinking wine, maybe too much, watching old movies, recalling happy times, and spying on her neighbors. Then the Russells move into the house across the way, a father, a mother, and their teenage son, the perfect family. But when Anna, gazing out her window one night, sees something she shouldn't, her world begins to crumble, and its shocking secrets are laid bare. What is real? What is imagined? Who is in danger? Who is in control? In this diabolical, gripping thriller, no one and nothing is what it seems. It sounds like a really, really good book, and I thought this would be like a cool book to read together. So this is book number one. If you want this one, make sure to vote for this one. Book number two is this one. It's The Wife Between Us. And I thought like this, just by the title, it sounded very interesting. So what is this one about? About. It says, when you read this book, you will make many assumptions. Hmm. You will assume you are reading about a jealous ex-wife. You assume she is obsessed with her replacement, a beautiful young woman who is about to marry the man they both love. You will assume you know the anatomy of this tangled love triangle. Assume nothing. It says right here, this is a twisty and a very dangerously chilling book. And I think this would be another really great book to read with y'all and very interesting. And I, I'm just, I'm hooked already. So um, if you like this one, please vote for book number two, The Wife Between Us. The next two books are on my Kindle. I haven't had a chance to read them myself yet. The next one is this one right here. It's called The Deal with the Devil. And I forgot with this one, this book is by Gear Hendrix and Sarah Pickenin. Yeah, I probably butchered all of that, but that, that is the authors right there. So let's go ahead, jump back to The Deal with the Devil. And this one is by Mega March, another one of my favorite authors that I love. You can put the man in a suit and he'll never be tamed. One look at Jericho Forge, and I know the rumors were true. He was a predator and he had set his sights on me. I know better than to bet more than I could afford to lose that night. I knew better than to bet myself, but desperation leads to bad decisions. And I thought there was no way I could lose. I was wrong. Now I have no choice but to make a deal with the devil. Like, this sounds really, really good. I can see here that I'm looking on online. It has two other books as well. Uh, so yes, I am excited to read this one. If you want to read it, this one, please vote for book number three, The Deal with the Devil. And the last and final book that I'm going to present to you guys to choose from, it is called A Reckless Note. And this one is by Elisa Renee Jones and another, again, another one of my favorite authors. So 
This reckless note is the first of three, I, I, I'm pretty sure. What is the reckless note about? It all started with a note. Just a simple note handwritten by a woman I didn't know, never even met. But in that note is perhaps every answer to every question I ever had in my life. And because of that note, I look for her, but I find him. I'm drawn to his passion, his talent, a darkness in him that somehow becomes my light, my life. Casey August is rich, powerful, a rock star of violence, a man who is all tattoos, leather, good looks, and talent. He has a wickedly sweet ability to play that violin, seducing an audience worldwide. Now he's seducing me. I know he has secrets, I don't care, because you see, I have secrets too. I'm not Arya Arlen as he believes. I'm Arya, I wanted to butcher this name. I am Arya Stra Stradivari, Stradivari, Stradivari. Let's, I'll put it up on the screen. Arya Stradivari, daughter of the Alessandro Stradivari, a musician born from the same blood as the man who created the famous Stradivarius violin. I am as rare as the mere 650 instruments my ancestors created. Instruments worth millions, 650 masterpieces, the brilliance unmatched, 650 reasons to kill. 650 reasons to hide one reason not to him so that sounds even more interesting ah! and um i'm hooked i'm going to read them all at one point but this is definitely like a great book to read with you guys so if you want to read this one a reckless note by lisa renee jones that is book number four Four. and so yeah you guys are gonna have one week to pick your favorite book and the highest book that is mentioned often or the book that has the most likes but we are all going to read that book so go down below and get to voting and i can't wait to start reading with you guys other than that thank you so much for watching i'll catch you back next week with another awesome video bye